Hi guys. So when I'm on the road, I don't need any hairspray to look great. And I can tell you, you definitely don't need that sort of thing in the workshop. Not when it comes to fitting a belt at least. A friend recently complained about a squeaky multi-V belt. A quick spray from a can and what do you know, the noise was gone. Guys, these sprays don't treat the cause, just the symptoms. You all know what happens with sneakers on a sports hall floor. They sometimes squeak too, but that's no big deal. It actually means you've got a good grip on the floor. But if you were now to spray a little dishwashing detergent on the sole, it would get rid of the noise, but you would no longer have any grip and you'd end up sprawled on the floor. It's the same with the belt. If you spray something on it, you'll get rid of the noises, but then you'll have a slippery belt. In other words, reduced friction. And it's precisely that friction that we are looking for in the belt. After a short time, the friend found the noises were back, as the expensive belt spray had quickly evaporated because of the friction-generated temperature. But worse still, the stuff had been absorbed into the material and damaged the surface. The belt was ruined. There are sprays available on the market that are specifically designed to increase the coefficient of friction and belt adhesion. For those two, my recommendation is keep well away. Usually it's not the belt that is responsible for the squeaking noises, but a misaligned drive or a damaged bearing. And no spray will solve that. The only solution for that is proper diagnosis and the appropriate repair. Okay? Then please leave a like below and write a comment for us. If you still have any questions, check out our PIC. Till next time in your workshop.